Okay, this is the cervical flexion exercise. This is another isometric exercise, so nothing is moving. We are working to engage and strengthen the stabilizing muscles of the neck. The motion on this one is going to be a force directly through the forehead from front to back. Again, but nothing is moving. So if I were to do it on Michelle, essentially, you just hold nice and still. I would be pushing straight through the forehead just until those muscles engage, nothing more. Now, I could easily overpower her head and just push it backwards. That's not the point here. So we essentially just want her to hold very still and try not to move while there's some pressure from front to back. So she's going to do it herself using the palms of her hands. Notice, notice she's using both hands. That will um, help make sure that the vector is straight front to back. Again, she's just sitting nice and straight. Nothing is moving, but her hands are pushing through her forehead so that everything engages in the neck. Um, and she's uh, getting that isometric exercise. The mistake people will make on this one is they'll just use one hand. The problem is, is that it's very hard to push straight front to back. Usually that elbow is going to be out to the side and they're going to be kind of pushing from the side. Um, we don't want that. So both palms of the hands pushing straight forward to back. Only enough pressure to where everything engages in the neck. Um, we get all those stabilizers activated. We hold that for about 10 seconds or whatever is prescribed on your sheet and then relax. That's the cervical flexion exercise.